Hi, my name is Sharon McKenzie, and I'm Executive Director of Eye to Eye Intergenerational Society. June 1st is Intergenerational Day Canada in its 11th year of celebration from east to west, St. John's, Newfoundland, right to Victoria, BC, and north to south. It's a day to remind you to reach out to someone from another generation, younger or older, and include them in your all-age friendly community. Make every day in Canada Intergenerational Day. Thank you. Let's celebrate Intergenerational Day by reaching out and talking to the older adults in our life. We might just find that their wisdom, their experience, and their perspective will bring us hope and inspiration for the future. Hello, I'm Mayor Don Iveson from the City of Edmonton, and I know that this year has been especially challenging for all of us. We've all felt the effects of isolation and not being able to connect with the people that we love. So today is Intergenerational Day Canada, and I would like to encourage all of us to think about ways we can connect with someone from a different generation, whether digitally or hopefully safely in person. We are stronger together, and we deserve to feel safe and connected to our community. And so now I'd like to present the following proclamation. Whereas isolation and loneliness are linked to serious public health risks and can affect people of all ages, especially youth and seniors, and whereas the global pandemic has exacerbated an already difficult situation for people struggling to feel connected, and whereas Intergenerational Day Canada recognizes and celebrates the importance of respectful and purposeful relationships between older adults and youth, and whereas this day encourages simple and fun engagement between generations as a way to eliminate isolation and loneliness and build community. Therefore, I, Mayor Don Iveson, do hereby proclaim June 1st, 2021, Intergenerational Day Canada in Edmonton, Alberta's capital city. Hello, my name is Liam Palmier. I'm a board member with the Compassionate Neighborhood Health Partner Society. I want to wish everyone a happy Intergenerational Day on June 1st, and I hope that more young people become inspired to work with older generations because of just how much they have to offer. Bonjour à toutes et à tous, ici Eric Marquis, maire de la ville d'Edmundston. Je tiens à vous souhaiter une belle journée intergénérationnelle. Hi, my name is Ruby Haycott and I'm the executive director of Linkages Society of Alberta. This pandemic year leading up to June 1st has highlighted that long-term intergenerational connections are so much more than nice to have programs. They're critical foundational supports for the physical, mental, and emotional health of all Canadians. So on behalf of our board, staff, and wonderful volunteers, thank you for all that you do in your communities to support intergenerational programming and have a safe and happy intergenerational day. Happy Intergenerational Day from Frederick, New Brunswick. I'm Penny Pacey, founder of Age, Adopt a Grandparent Elder, and Wise, Welcoming Interactions with Social Elders. It's a wonderful day to celebrate connecting generations, defeating senior social isolation, and isolation for younger people as well. Have a great day. Take care. Bye. Bonjour tout le monde. Je suis Don Arnold, la mairesse de la ville de Moncton. Happy Intergenerational Day. In Moncton, our Mayor's Youth Advisory Committee and our Seniors Advisory Committee are coming together to celebrate. Je vous encourage à s'engager dans la promotion de cette importante initiative. I, Sandra Masters, Mayor of the City of Regina, Saskatchewan, do hereby proclaim the day of June 1st as Intergenerational Day in our city. It's important to learn from the wisdom of elders and see the world through the eyes of children. Hi, I'm Mabel Elmore the MLA for Vancouver Kensington, and the Parliamentary Secretary for Senior Services and Long-Term Care. It's so crucial for seniors and youth to connect and build community. And British Columbia is proud to proclaim June 1st as Intergenerational Day Canada. I'm New Brunswick Premier Blaine Higgs, encouraging you to mark Intergenerational Day on June 1st. La journée intergenerationnelle et l'occasion de célébrer l'importance d'établir des relations entre les générations. La COVID-19 pandemic has highlighted the importance of developing connections between seniors and young people and ensuring no one in our community feels isolated or alone. Nous pouvons tout aider à encourager les liens entre les personnes âgées et les jeunes. This year, on Intergenerational Day, 
Let's take a moment to appreciate the importance of connecting across generations. Thank you. Merci. Each generation in Winnipeg has something they can teach the other. Here's to bridge building between different generations throughout our community. Happy Intergenerational Day. Hello, I'm Nancy Grant, Mayor of Rothsay, wishing everyone a very happy Intergenerational Day from the Rothsay Hive Age-Friendly Community Centre. Hi everyone, I'm Alexis with Toronto Intergenerational Partnerships, wishing you a happy Intergenerational Day. Uh, the most important thing that we can do for each other is to listen and learn and be there for each other. Again, happy Intergenerational Day. Bonjour, Yvon Lapierre, maire de la ville de Dieppe. Au nom du conseil municipal et en mon nom, il me fait plaisir de vous souhaiter une bonne journée en ce 1er juin, une bonne journée intergénérationnelle. À Dieppe, l'intergénérationnel, c'est toute la communauté. Hello, Yvon Lapierre, Mayor of the City of Dieppe. On this 1st of June, I'm happy to celebrate with you Intergenerational Day. June 1st is Intergenerational Day in Canada, where we celebrate the benefits of building intergenerational relationships. The City of St. John's offers many intergenerational initiatives. During this time, it is now important more than ever to reach out and connect. Hello, I'm Mayor Lisa Helps, and I'd like to wish everybody a happy intergenerational day on June 1st. Really important, particularly given the state of the world right now, that younger people and older people find ways to build community, take care of each other, and share love. Hello, by working with these two age groups will certainly benefit us all. Thank you. I am Mayor Mike Savage with a proclamation for Intergenerational Day, which is June the 1st, 2021. Whereas Intergenerational Day Canada on June the 1st raises awareness about the power of making simple, respectful intergenerational connections. Whereas Intergenerational Day Canada, June the 1st, is a day to focus on the profound positive influence intergenerational connecting has on eliminating isolation and loneliness, moving toward healthy, all age friendly communities. Whereas International Day Canada on June the 1st celebrates the good things presently taking place between generations in our local community. Whereas Intergenerational Day Canada June 1st encourages simple, fun, intergenerational sharing. And whereas Intergenerational Day Canada June 1st is an official reminder, a yearly invitation for every citizen to take one small respectful step to bridge generations within his or her local community. It only takes a smile between generations to break through isolation and loneliness, the number one health concern for children, youth, and older persons. Therefore, be it resolved that I, Mayor Mike Savage, on behalf of all of Halifax Regional Council do hereby proclaim June the 1st, 2021 as Intergenerational Day in the Halifax Regional Municipality, dated in Halifax, Nova Scotia, the first day of June, 2021, Mike Savage, Mayor. Happy Intergenerational Day. Today is a day to celebrate the mutual benefits of building relationships across generations. The broader purpose of Intergenerational Day is to enhance awareness of elder abuse. Please join me, together we can prevent mistreatment of older adults and build age-friendly communities across Canada. I'm Sangeeta Nair from the Victoria General Hospital Foundation in Winnipeg, Manitoba. This year, the Victoria General Hospital Foundation and the Victoria Lifeline partnered with Fort Richmond Collegiate to launch the Calls for Comfort program. Seniors are matched with students and participate in weekly phone conversations where they get to know each other and exchange stories and experiences. We encourage you to celebrate this day with us by connecting with someone from a different generation. Here's wishing you a happy intergenerational day. Hi everyone, I'm Bukola Abiola from IGNMB. I wish you all a happy intergenerational day. For a stronger and better community, we all need to come together 
to share, care, and foster intergenerational connections and living. Thank you. I'm Everett Hindley, Saskatchewan's Minister of Mental Health and Addictions, Seniors, and Rural and Remote Health. As we celebrate Intergenerational Day on June 1st, one of the most important things that's changed in the past 14 months because of the COVID-19 pandemic and the restrictions is how we communicate between younger individuals and our senior citizens and older adults. And I want to thank the people of Saskatchewan and across Canada for finding new and unique ways to remain connected throughout these challenging times. Hi, my name is Sarah Dyer, and I'm the age-friendly and community well-being specialist with BC Healthy Communities. June 1st marks Intergenerational Day, a day to acknowledge the vital role that intergenerational connections play in building healthy and age-friendly communities. Particularly in light of the current restrictions, it's important to take time to make these connections within your community. So on June 1st, don't forget to take some time to reach out to someone you know from another generation. Hello, my name is Sharon McKenzie, and I'm lead on an initiative in New Brunswick as part of the New Brunswick Healthy Seniors Pilot Project. The initiative is called Intergenerational Action Plan. And let me tell you, New Brunswick is really getting into the intergenerational action. And they challenge you, the rest of the country, on June 1st, Intergenerational Day Canada, reach out to somebody in your community, younger or older, and bring them into your social circle, either virtually or at a safe distance. For more information, go to intergenerational.ca and for sure, make every day in Canada and in New Brunswick an intergenerational day. Thank you.